Hello guys, uh, well it's mid-November now and uh, I don't know about you fellas but my fishing has slowed down a little bit. I've been having a great time since the end of lockdown but uh, in fact I've never caught so many fish I don't think in, in such a small space of time but I've been going quite regular, uh, more regular than I used to do and uh, it, it's definitely showing in the results, uh, keen as ever. Uh, now, a lot of you probably be aware that I'm with a company called Vital Baits, and they're based in Spain, of all places, uh, owned by a, a, a Danish family. And uh, basically, I, I, I'm going to, I suppose everyone will say this, but I've never been so happy using uh, a bait for a very, very long time. Uh, and what's happened is Nicky and Marley and his wife have... Uh, kindly let me have a little bit of rain with some of the things I'm doing and uh, so I'm making uh, a signature bait which I've always wanted to to do this particular recipe and we've been testing that's been good but first of all with it being coming into winter uh, one of the little gems that I discovered with Vital is uh, the Nutty Crunch bait. Now I heard about this way before I was with Vital because uh, I used to fish rainbow fairly frequently and uh, I'd heard about this this bait doing very well in the colder months in particular and uh, Nicky who owns Vital uh, his first trip he had uh, a fish called the Scar Face Common I think it was 83 biggest fish in the lake and he had several other fish uh, recently some of the some of the guys from Spain in his in his team went on to Rainbow not so long ago, just, you know, maybe maybe a couple of three weeks ago, and they had six 30-kilo-plus uh, fish, all on the Nutty Crunch, and uh, it would appear to be an outstanding cold-weather bait. I'll just show you what it looks like. It's uh, different nut meals, uh, tiger nut. It's got, do you know the old uh, milk beer and answer? I mean, I used to roll all my single hook baits myself, uh, I used to use a Nutribates Milk Bonanza that was absolutely awesome. Well, it smells like that, like a very creamy, uh, nutty, um, I, I suppose, like a lactose smell to it. Uh, and that's, you can get it in white, like this. It's got biscuit meal in it as well. Or you can get it in a more understated brown colour like this. So you've got the two colours that you can use. Uh, you also get the... Nutty Crunch Dip, which smells really quite lush. Makes the baits go hard, as you'd expect. I mean, it really is intensely creamy. Um, and you get fluoros with it, you get barrels, wafter barrels. These are the uh, 10 mil dumbbells. You can get the white fluoros. I mean, there's a range of different colours to go with it. And you even get Enterprise have done a nutty crunch corn because they know it's a, an outstanding flavour. So if you want to tip it with corn, you've got that as well. Uh, I think it's, I mean, I get asked, I asked by a lot of people, would you change to uh, another bait in winter? Well, I don't always do that. I intend to use the, the other bait that we've been testing, the Mojo, all the way through. But as I always say, you've got you've got three rods, maybe two rods, three rods, four rods even on some waters. What's wrong with ringing the changes and doing a comparison? So sometimes you might want to try, which is exactly what I'm doing now, uh, a visual bait. There's not many there's not many baits where the freebies are very white like that. So that's well worth the shout. And uh, as I say, it's uh, it's quite an interesting proposition. Um, and it works in summer, I might add. I used it in Italy uh, a year ago. Well, more than a year ago now. It was probably a year last September. And I had uh, a 60, 69 and a 59 on it. First time I tried it. Uh, it's quite impressed with that. I use big baits as well there. And the sizes, just out of interest, are... Um, 18 mil, 14 mil, and you can also get them in 24s. If you're fishing a big fish venue or you want to try something a bit different, so you can try the 24s. Uh, I know 
a lot of the European guys like the big baits, but in England we tend to go small. But now and again, it's well worth ringing the changes and trying a, a big bait. And uh, I remember some years ago watching a guy turn up with these 24s, 26 mil baits on Reedsmere. And we were all laughing at him, taking the mickey, and he had a string of all the biggest fish in the lake. So, uh, you know, it's just food for thought, really. It's, it's well worth considering trying that. And, uh, yeah, so Nutty Crunch, Vital Baits, well worth a shout, especially in the colder months. So uh, look out for that one.